A woman fighting City Hall for her flock. A Plainville woman says her chickens are pets, not farm animals. And now she's trying to convince planning and zoning that that's what's happening there. News 8 Stephanie Simone found out, though, it might be a tough sell. Be a pretty chick. Feathers are ruffled in Plainville. Give me a kiss. Most know Roberta LaLama as Mama Cluck. I'm Mama Cluck, and I'm proud of it. She's been told by the Zoning Commission several times, Leisha, Ebony, Buffy, and the rest of the Hen Mansion residents are against the law. When she thinks of letting them go, I cry. I just, they're my friends. They're my girls. City Hall learned about her feathery friends after a neighbor called and complained about one escape artist in his yard. Yup, Houdini fled, flew the coop, and it's happened twice. I spoke to the director of the Zoning and Planning Commission here in Plainville. He did not want to do an on-camera interview, but he did say you need two acres to have chickens. Right now, she only has a quarter of an acre, and while he says he feels for her situation, she is disobeying town law. Why would you get the chickens if you knew you needed two acres? But I didn't. It never occurred to me. So she tried to get a zoning variance, an exception to the law. That was shot down. Then she worked to change the law. That didn't work either. But Mama Cluck isn't ready to give up her flock. My friends that already have chicks and friends that want them, we are going to pursue this and try to convince the town of Plainville not to be so small-minded. If only the chicken came first before the law, maybe this whole hen fight would have been avoided. In Plainville, Stephanie Simone, News 8.